Oxygen came out this year and it was directed by Alejandro Aya and starred Melanie Laurent, Matthew R. Amarok, and a bunch of unknown other actors. In this movie, we follow a woman who is in a cryogenic chamber with no recollection of how she got there, and she must find out a way before running out of air. Which, alone itself, is a very simple plot, but it made for a very interesting movie. This movie was really good. I really liked Effective. Alexandre Aja, he is a director that I've always respected. Yes, not everything he touches is golden, but I think he puts effort in what he does. Movies like The Piranha 3D, I enjoy. I loved his remake of The Hills Have Eyes. Crawl, I actually liked. Don't sue me. I have not seen High Tension, but I've heard about it. I'll get to it. Mirrors, I think, is a very underrated. Yes, it it was a remake of a movie about mirrors, but I think it was a very I think it was very underappreciated. It was a, and just that concept alone easily scares you. Honestly, you should not be one to look at a mirror ever again. But that movie was actually, I thought it was kind of decent. Oxygen, I think, really does in what it set out to do. It's very effective, and it's, there's a lot of high tension here. I think the high tension in this movie is really strong, it's really creative. Due to Alexandre Aha's direction and his execution, and just the way he shoots this movie as far as the cinematography standpoint goes. It's a very well done cinematography, it's very great. And just this idea alone, you being frozen and not being able to remember who you were, and you have to try and remember who you was and get out of the situation before you end up dying. It is very, very reminiscent of other movies we've seen before, but it does it in a way that was interesting and it was very well done. For, the characters in the movie are aren't entertain aren't good so good at best but you're mainly following melody neurons who is a gorgeous beautiful french woman and she i like melody neurons an actress in glorious bastards she was great i really loved her in of course i loved her in six underground six underground that was a fun movie she, even though she's a French actress, she's one of, one of my favorite French actresses right next to Leah Sadow. And I gotta say, she, do, she, do, she does an amazing job. She does great acting work here. She was great in Enemy, which was directed by Denis Villeneuve. Anything, for the stuff I see in her in, she's great. And I can't wait to see what else she does next. Cinematography wise is very beautiful. It's a gorgeous looking movie. Cinematography, this movie is gorgeous. The production design, you're mainly following the her for most of the movie. There are some other characters. I think the other actors do good, but I love but I watched this movie because she was in it. And I thought she was really good. So I really liked what what she did here. I liked the way this movie is shot, the way the movie was Directed Maxime Alejandre is a very great cinematographer. He knows what he's doing. His cinematography in P2 was really great. That's a very underrated movie with Rachel Nichols. If you only seen that movie, check that out. Also, the editing in this movie this movie is an hour and 41 minutes. It is entirely in French, so I will say that right now. If you are not used to the French, audio i will say this right now you may not like be into it but i will give it a chance it's one of the better netflix movies to ever come out this year issues yes it is a bit familiar and it is the characters aren't the most developed but this movie is very claustrophobic 
this is a very great thriller that's done right and I really enjoyed it so at the end of the day I was very happy with this initially Anne Hathaway was gonna do this but she stepped down and the original director stepped down too this was originally called O2 as well so at the end of the day I have to say that this movie right here is is, is entertaining Oxygen is a pretty solid directorial effort from Alexander Aha that delivers on what it sets out to do despite it being a bit familiar. Melanie Norrie is good here and elevates this movie up a lot and there's a lot of great tension moments here. Not bad for a horror movie, very decent and I'm gonna give Oxygen a highly recommend it. Let me know in the comments below what did you think of Oxygen. Did you like it? Did you not like it? Or are you somewhere right in the middle? All my social media links and description box down below. You guys keep it cool. Enjoy the epitaphs.